Hello children, today in this video we are going to do chapter 20 perimeter and area of a plane figure. Before starting this chapter children, first of all what is perimeter and area? Now children, what is the perimeter of plane figures? The perimeter of a closed figure is the sum of the lengths of all the sides. In a polygon there are n number of sides children. So sum of n number of sides is equals to its perimeter. Like in a square, how many sides are there? Four sides are there. So if we will add all the four sides, we will get all the four sides are equal in a square. So we will get four into length of a side or four into side. It is the perimeter of a square. Similarly, in a rectangle, opposite sides are equal. One is length, another one is breadth. So length plus length plus breadth plus breadth means 2 into length plus 2 into breadth. So 2 into length and 2 into breadth. 2 I will take common which is 2 L plus B. So perimeter of rectangle is equals to 2 length plus breadth. Similarly perimeter of a triangle is sum of all the sides. A B plus B C plus A C. This is a perimeter of a triangle. Perimeter actually is the outer part children. If we have to fence a garden we need the perimeter of the garden. Next is children area. Area means the internal part of anything. If we have to cement the floor, if we have to plow the field, it means we need the area of the figure. So children area, uh, area of the rectangle and square we will do over here. So area of square is equals to side square. If we will multiply side two times, means side into side, it is equals to area of the square. And area of rectangle is very simple. It is length into breadth. If you multiply length and breadth, we will get the area of a rectangle. Now children, question, uh, exercise 20.1. First question. The sides of a triangle are 5 cm, 6 cm and 7 cm. Find its perimeter. So what is the perimeter of a triangle children? AB plus BC plus CA. Sum of the three sides. Which is 5 plus 6 plus 7 which is equals to 18. Perimeter of a square is given to you 96 centimeter. Find the area of the square. So from the perimeter we will get the side and area of a square is side into side. So perimeter of a square is 96. Formula for the perimeter of square is 4 into side. It is equal to 96. Value of side is equals to 96 by 4. Cut it you will get 24. So side is equal to 24 and area of square is equals to side square means 24 square 24 into 24 which is equals to 576 centimeter square so area unit is centimeter square and unit of perimeter is only centimeter children with square we uh, with area we used to write square and with perimeter only centimeter <coughs> next children the perimeter of a rectangle is 50 meter its breadth is 12 meter Find its length. So perimeter is given to you 50 meter. Breadth is 12. What is the formula for perimeter of rectangle? It is 2 length plus breadth. So perimeter is given to you 50. 2 length we will write L only. And in place of breadth we will write 12. So 2 is being multiplied over here. We will shift 2 downwards. So 50 divided by 2 is equals to length plus 12. 50 divided by 2 is equals to 25. I will shift 12 towards this side. So 25 minus 12 is equals to length which is equals to 13 meter. So length is 13 meter. What we have to calculate in the second part? It is area. Area of rectangle is length into breadth. So length is 13 and breadth is 12. 13 into 12 is equals to 156. Unit you have to write it is meter square. Next children find the breadth and the perimeter of a rectangle. If its area is 96 cm square and the length is 12 cm. Now area is given to you 96 cm, length is 12 cm. So area of a rectangle is length into breadth. So value of area is given to you that is 96, length is 12 and breadth we have to calculate. So 96 by 12 is equals to B, breadth. When you will cancel you will get 8. 12 ones are 12, 8 is 96. So breadth is equals to 8 centimeter. Second part which we have to calculate is the perimeter. Perimeter of rectangle is 2 into length plus breadth. 
So 2 length is given to you 12, breadth is 8, 12 plus 8 is equals to 20. So 2 into 20 is equals to 40 centimeter. This is the perimeter children. Next the perimeter of a square courtyard is 144 meter. Find the cost of cementing it at the rate of rupees 15 per meter square. So perimeter of a square is given to you 144. What is the perimeter of a square? What is the formula? 4 into side it is equals to 144. So value of side is 144 by 4 which you will when you will divide it you will get 36. So side is 36 meter. What is the area of square? Side into side 36 into 36 which is 1296. Cost of cementing 1 meter square it is given to you rupees 15 and cost of cementing 1296 meter square it is 15 into 1296. When you will multiply you will get rupees 19,440. This is your answer. Next is children the sides of a rectangle are in the ratio. Now it is given to you in ratio 4 ratio 5 and its perimeter is 90. Find the dimension of a rectangle. Dimension means you have to calculate the length and the breadth of a rectangle. So what we are going to do because it is given to you in ratio. So let the length is 4x. Some constant we have to write with this. That constant be x. Let the breadth is equals to 5x. Perimeter is given to you 90. So perimeter of rectangle is 90. Formula is 2 length plus breadth is equals to 90. So now solve it and put the value of length and breadth over here. So 2 length is 4x, breadth is 5x. 4 plus 5 is 9x and 9 into 2 is 18x is equals to 90. Value of x will be 90 by 18 which is equals to 5. Now we have to calculate the length and breadth. So length is equals to 4 into 5 20 centimeter and breadth is equals to 5 into 5 25 centimeter. Second part of this question area of a rectangle we have to calculate. So area of rectangle is student length into breadth. So 20 into 25 which is equals to 500 centimeter square will come. Now children next is find the cost of fencing a rectangular garden at the rate of rupees 7.5 per meter. If its length and breadth are in the ratio 4 ratio 3 and area is given to you 1200 meter. Now children this question is almost similar to the previous one. Same let the length is 4x breadth be 3x. Area is given to you 1200. What is the area of rectangle? Length into breadth. It is equal to 1200. 4x into 3x is equal to 1200. 12x square because x into x is x square. So it is equal to 1200. x square is equal to 1200 by 12. When you will cancel you will get 100. Here it is x square is equals to now which number I will multiply 2 times so that I will get 100 same number it is 10 into 10 so it will be 10 square square and square cancel value of x is 10 therefore the length is equals to 4 into 10 40 meter breadth is equals to 3 into 10 30 meter and perimeter of rectangle is 2 into length plus breadth and length is 40 breadth is 30. 40 plus 30, 70. 2 into 70 is 140 meter. Now cost of fencing 1 meter is equals to rupees 7.5. And cost of fencing 140 meter, it is 140 into 7.5. When you will multiply them, you will get 1050. Eighth question, the cost of cementing a square courtyard at the rate of rupees, uh, at rupees 11 per square meter is rupees uh, 1100 means total cost is 1100 and cost of cementing 1 meter square is rupees 11. Find the cost of fencing it at the rate of rupees 10 per meter. Now children total cost of cementing given to you rupees 1100 and cost of cementing is given uh, of 1 meter square is given to you rupees 11. For cementing we always want the area of the square courtyard. So area of a square is this is the formula area of a square courtyard is equals to total cost upon cost of uh, cementing. So total cost is 1100 and cost of cementing 1 meter square is 11. When you will cancel you will get 100. What is the area of square? It is side square. It is equals to 100 and side square is equals to 10 square. Means side is equals to 10. 
If side we have got 10, what is the perimeter of a square? 4 into side, which means 4 into 10, which is equals to 40 meter. Now cost of fencing 1 meter is rupees 10. This is given to you. And cost of fencing 40 meter is equals to 40 into 10, which is equals to rupees 400. Next question children. Last question of this exercise. Find the cost of flooring the veranda at the rate of rupees 12 meter square if the length and the breadth of the veranda are in the ratio 3 ratio 2 and its perimeter is 40. Again the same thing. Let the length be 3x. Let the breadth be 2x. Perimeter of a rectangle is given to you 40. Formula is 2 length plus breadth is equals to 40. 2 will come as it is. Length is 3x. Breadth is 2x. So 3 plus 2 is 5x. 2 into 5x. 10x is equals to 40. x is equals to 40 by 10 which is equals to 4. Now length is equals to 3 into 4 12. Breadth is equals to 2 into 4 8 meter. Area of rectangle is length into breadth 12 into 8 which is equals to 96 meter square. Cost of flooring 1 meter square is equals to rupees 12. And cost of flooring 96 meter square will be 96 into 12 which is equals to rupees 1152. So children by this we have completed our 20th chapter also. Thank you children. Do this chapter in your notebooks. Thank you children.